Okay, it has been forever since I've done any vlogs and I'm sorry I fell off the face of the earth. So I've got a ton of updates for you. But first, I wanted to show you our puppies that we currently have. We have one golden doodle litter and one Bernadoodle litter. Ronnie's litter is the golden doodle litter. This is her last litter. She is retiring after this for sure. A family friend is gonna take her for her retirement, which is awesome because we didn't wanna just send our dogs to anybody for their retirement. So it's great to know that she's gonna go to a friend of ours. And then Akira's puppies are F1 Bernadoodles and they're doing great. There's 10 of them and then there's six of Ronnie's puppies. So I'm gonna show them to you. How's it going down here? Good. I like your show. Akira, why are your babies whining? Akira, are you going to feed your babies or not? Tinker? Oh, Kira. They want you. Alright kids, show me your puppies. Which one do you got, Jordan? I got Sapphire. Sapphire. You cutie. I got Diamond. Is... I, like... I got Diamond. Yes, you do. Pretty little Diamond. He is quite crazy. He is. Be gentle with him. Who do you have? Ruby. Ruby. So sweet. Okay. I got emerald. Yeah, emerald. So if you haven't figured it out yet, these are the, this is the gemstone litter. Um, so we named them after gemstones. This litter was interesting. Jordan, maybe you should just put them down. Okay, but he's my favorite puppy. I know, but he's just so wiggly. Okay, so we named them after gemstones. This litter was so interesting because last time we got lots of tricolors and lots of white. These are almost all phantom. The only puppies that are tricolors are the girls. There's three girls, and those are the tricolors. So, who knows, maybe it's a genetic thing, so like the one that Blair's holding. Ruby is a girl, and she's a tricolor. Um, so it makes it easy to know which ones are the girls, and which one's not. This one right, right down there, that you can barely see the white on her, but um, she's all curled up. Right there, that's a tricolor, so she's a girl. We also got three phantoms, or three merles, and then the rest are phantoms, which Brian and I both agree. We love the phantoms. We think they're really cool looking. Jordan, let me see. So these puppies are two and a half weeks old. They're almost three weeks old. Actually, in two days, they'll be three weeks old. So we've got them started on a litter box, which needs to be cleaned out and changed. Okay, these are Ronnie's Golden Doodle Puppies. These are minis. So they will only be about 20 pounds when they grow up. 20 to 30 what pounds when they grow up. So Riley, which one do you have? Marsha. Marsha? Jordan, which one do you have? Peter. Peter? All right, so we got a Marsha, a Peter. We've got Greg, Bobby, Jan, and Cindy. Any guesses as to what the theme of this litter is? <laughs> the Brady Bun. So this litter, for some, they are just fat, chunky, lazy puppies. It is fat puppies. Look at those fat puppies. That one is gray. <laughs> that, with me, that one's a boy. Gonna wake up, guys. I got have a good gray. meal. We've got I gray. got gray. This is Jan. She's got a really cute nose. I got gray. A really cute face. I got gray. <sighs> Um, so you guys can take the puppy pads, the white ones with the pellets on them, and try to dump it all into here, okay? The, and the, then, the yeah, the garbage ones. Oh. And then all the other stuff you can give to me for laundry.
Okay. What are you doing under there? Dad, we have candy. Oh, you stinkers. You found my secret stash of candy. Oh dear. No, put them on the pee pad there. On the litter box. Oh. Yeah, so on the other one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you doing a trick? Careful. Don't trip. I think that one's really cool. Mm hmm. Jade? Yeah, we'll see uh, that one. No, that one. That one's Jade. That's Jade. This one is Poppy. I know. And this one is Ivy. Okay. Oh, no. Our tour of updates of all the things that I fell behind on telling you um, the next update I wanted to give was about the goats so <laughs> we had been talking about um, getting some kind of livestock dairy animal uh, for a while we thought about a cow for a while but it just seemed like too much of an investment too big of a deal so we ended up getting these goats I had goats when I was a kid so um, I'm fairly familiar with them we got three Nigerian dwarf goats um, we got these because they are a dairy breed the plan is to use their milk for um, puppies if we need it. If um, for some reason a mom isn't able to nurse the puppies, goat milk is the best substitute for dogs, for puppies and kittens and all that stuff. They have done a great job of clearing the fence line of weeds. This fence line had all these vines growing up it and weeds that just we just were falling behind on taking care of. So you can see all over there, no weeds. Um, over here, you can see up there, um, where they uh, stopped being able to reach. They cleared up all that, but all the grass down by the fence line, it's been awesome. So the biggest question we had was if the dogs would tolerate the goats. And um, we decided to keep, take it slow and slowly acclimate them to each other. The goats are in this side pen for now, and we are taking the dogs in with them on leashes and establishing that the goats are off limits, um, giving them treats when they ignore the goats or walk away from the goats even though they really want to chase them. So far, Reagan has been the best as far as leaving the goats alone. Ronnie, oh. she, some days she's good, some days she's not. Akira is crazy. She, I think it's because she has puppies, but she goes nuts. She just like wants to chase the goats so bad. So it's going to take a long time for her to learn. Um, we haven't tried Denali yet. Winston was good. He like picked up right away that like he's not allowed to chase the goat. Oh well, we haven't tried Izzy yet. So we're just trying to slowly acclimate them all to each other and hopefully we'll be able to let the goats back in the big backyard where they can eat all kinds of bushes and trees and stuff that goats like to eat. This is Ivy. Ivy is the most tame. The pretty one there is Poppy. And that's Sage. That one right there is Poppy. And Sage is the black one. We named them after plants. Because we want them to eat the weed. So Blair. They want one leg now in my hand. Yeah.
Suki! She's fighting Ronnie.